hello guys welcome back to Revit 2016 video tutorials in this video tutorial we'll go through uh, let's see so in this video tutorial we'll go through the foundations particularly uh, rectangular foundations or I will show you how to even do the square foundations so let me open the file where did I save it in documents Revit okay make sure you save the project all the time so this is the 3d view 3d view and you can see there are four uh, we have installed uh, piles there are four piles with a pile cap let us go to basement you can even see in, uh, in some other uh, elevation the piles starting at the basement level so let me say uh, I need one more slab over here so what I'll just do is or uh, never mind I'll do it in the, some free time let us go for the foundations so go to basement so, so as you can see these are the piles and let me say I will have rectangular foundations over here over here and over here what I'll do is I'll go to structure I'll select isolated and then in here I'll select um, footing rectangular so uh, our pile size is this our pile size is uh, 100 inches by 100 inches by um, 35 inches depth so we will just convert this to the same dimensions so 100 inches is 8 feet 4 inches length is same 8 feet I can just uh, cancel this select edit type select a duplicate first and let us give this as rectangular no square square okay now say 8 feet 4 inches 8 feet 4 inches and 2 feet 11 inches select ok now you can just uh, paste wherever you want what I'll just do is I'll paste in a sequence okay now I'm done with the pasting so I'll just cancel this and I'll select the foundations the square foundations and I'll copy paste them over here again copy over here again copy over here okay so now if you go and check it in 3d view you can find the rectangular foundations but uh, we have uh, like uh, isolated footings as like this 
we have a column coming upside so uh, if you want uh, the foundation to be uh, a little bit uh, deeper and you need to connect the column I mean you can do it manually but for that you need to prepare a foundation manually and uh, that's uh, that's some other in other in other class for now uh, this is just enough so uh, as you see we have pile foundations and rectangle uh, square foundations rectangular foundation is nothing but uh, you have a greater width than length or uh, vice versa so in this way we can uh, have square or rectangular foundations in our house building Thank you for watching the video.